This is a proper homemade traditional pie. And they've been serving these along with mash for over a century at AJ Goddard's on Deptford High Street, but not for much longer. Yeah, the rent and rates have gone up and all the, all the customers have moved away. And uh, I've got to go where the, where the money is. On October the 7th, it all comes to a close and the customers who do still go are heartbroken too. I've been coming here since I was a well, child. I used to come with mum, shopping up the market. We had three pies, uh, single mash, we come here as a kid. Obviously, uh, it's been a part of my life, basically. But two minutes down the road, you get an idea of why the trade has slowed for the pie shop. At Deptford Market Yard, you can get a plate of something very different, inspired by all corners of the world, and pie and mash is just one of many options. There is a lot of choice here, that's what's yeah. nice, yeah. And what do you usually go for then? Yes, uh, spicy food, um, pizzas, uh, salads. I don't know what the nutritional qu qualities of pie and mash are, but I can't imagine it's, uh, it's that good for you. And this is a cutthroat market. Last September, 44 restaurants opened that month alone. And what we've seen happen over the past few years is a huge explosion of new restaurants and new experiences. Deptford Market Yard, for example, um, is a place where you've got a number of street food type operators, you've got some retail, there's events that are happening in the square, and it's an experience. Even pie shops are reinventing themselves. Here at Mother Mash, which is just off of Carnaby Street, you can have cheesy mustard mash, you can have horseradish mash, you can have champ mash, which is Irish apparently, and you can have butternut squash and goat's cheese pie, and of course, a steak and owl pie as well. Gotta have some tradition. At AJ Goddard's, they're currently looking for a new home, but for now, it's nearly the end. Jim Weeble, BBC London News.